construction along the lake shore is in need of some cleaning, but this isn't your typical brush up job. Local 5's Bryce Oselin spoke with Manitowoc Maritime Museum officials about what this cleaning means for the future of the USS Cobia. Cobia's been here just over 50 years. Uh, she came here in 1970 and has uh, been here in Manitowoc ever since as a submarine memorial and then kind of as the centerpiece of the Wisconsin Maritime Museum. World War II submarine USS Cobia is set to receive a makeover. The federal grant will give the museum the opportunity to renovate the national landmark. The $500,000 grant uh, for USS Cobia dry docking, uh, it allows us to do the regular hull maintenance, kind of that below the waterline um, inspections and maintenance that needs to happen to make sure that Cobia is going to be here uh, for the next hundred years. Cobia received its last renovation 25 years ago. Green says she's looking forward to see the sub restored to its former glory. It's quite a process. We're excited. Uh, we think it's going to be a big celebration, but again, uh, really crucial for us to do this to maintain uh, this important piece of history. In Manitowoc, Bryce Oslin, Local 5 News. Thank you, Bryce. That dry docking procedure is expected to take years to complete.